AEW Dynamite starts with Chris Jericho coming out and he calls out Eddie Kingston and says he wants to shake Eddie's hand. Eddie comes out and says I only needed to win but what do you have missing inside of you that makes you not want to shake my hand? And Jericho shakes Eddie's hand then Daniel Garcia and 2.0 Matt Lee and Jeff Parker come out and beat down Eddie. Then Santana and Ortiz come out to make the save and Jericho hits Santana and Ortiz and Eddie with the baseball bat. Then Jake Hager comes out and helps Jericho beat down Santana and Ortiz and Hager power bombs Eddie through a table and Jericho says this is the Jericho appreciation society. Dante Martin versus Hangman Adam Page for the World Championship and Page wins with a buckshot lariat. After the match Page shakes Dante's hand and Adam Cole comes out and challenges Page to a 3 on 3 tag match next week and Cole says I have two young men in mind, two men that are my friends and not yours. Daniel Bryan and John Moxley with William Regal in their corner versus the workhorsemen Anthony Henry and JD Drake and Bryan wins with a label lock. After the match Regal thanks Shivani for helping him 29 years ago and Regal says Bryan is the perfect wrestler. Bryan became everything he couldn't because Bryan doesn't have the problems he does. And what a perfect combination, the perfect wrestler and the man who will take things to another level, so that's why this team is together. And Regal says whoever steps in the ring with them, you will step up or get stepped on. Backstage, Adam Page walks up to the Dark Order and they're excited asking which two of them is Page picking for the match next week. And Page says he ran into Jungle Boy and Luchasaurus just before and chose them for next week. Wheeler Yuta with Orange Cassidy and Danhausen and best friends Chuck Taylor and Trent in his corner versus Pac with Pentagon or Scooter and Alex Abrahantes in his corner and Pac wins with the Brutalizer. Backstage, Adam Cole is with Red Dragon, Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish and the Young Bucks Matt and Nick Jackson and Cole says next week his partners know how to throw a party and Matt says let me stop you there. I told you if it has to do with Hangman, we're not in. And Cole says I was going to pick Red Dragon anyway, and Cole walks off. FTR, Dax Harwood and Cash Wheeler with Tully Blanchard are being interviewed backstage, and Dax talks about his family, and Tully interrupts and says me being with you two is supposed to be about winning tag team championships, and Dax grabs Tully and says this is about my family, and Cash says to Tully this is about family, and you're not it, you're fired. Matt Hardy is in the ring with Andrade and his assistant, and the Butcher and the Blade and Private Party, Mark Quinn and Isaiah Cassidy, and Matt says every time I put on a suit I turn into an asshole, and Andrade says he wants to take a vote on whether or not to kick Matt out and Andrade and his assistant put their thumbs down, Matt has his up and Private Patty have theirs up too but then they turn them to a thumbs down and Andrade says you need to watch your back and Matt sees Private Party have their thumbs down and everybody beats down Matt but Darby Allen and Sting come out but they're outnumbered then Jeff Hardy makes his debut and drops Mark and the Butcher and hits a swanton bomb on the blade. Backstage Shane Swerve Strickland is being interviewed and Tony Nese says he wants to welcome Swerve to AEW on Rampage in a match. Wardlow comes out and has a good promo about why he worked for MJF. He says he always wanted to be a wrestler and wanted the money to take care of his family but now Wardlow is not Max's bodyguard and not in the pinnacle and Wardlow wants to win the TNT Championship and he's not stopping with that. He wants it all and says all Elite Wrestling is officially Wardlow's world. QT Marshall tells Keith Lee backstage that they have a common enemy in Team Taz. QT says he has Keith's back and Keith says my back is pretty big so I'm good and walks off and QT says you'll pay for this Keith. Jungle Boy and Luchasaurus with Christian Cage in their corner versus the acclaimed Max Caster and Anthony Bowens for the tag team titles and Jungle Boy wins with a clothesline to Bowens while Bowens is on Luchasaurus' shoulders. Layla Hirsch versus Thunder Rosa. During the match Layla grabs a turnbuckle piece from under the ring but Red Velvet comes out and takes it away from Layla and throws her back in the ring and Rosa wins with a thunder drive. After the match, Tony Schiavone announces next week Thunder Rosa vs Britt Baker for the Women's Championship in a steel cage. Scorpio Sky with Ethan Page and Dan Lambert in his corner vs Sammy Guevara for the TNT Championship in the main event. During the match, Sammy hits a 6.30 to the outside through a table, but Scorpio moves. Then Tay Conti comes out to check on Sammy, and the doctors are helping Sammy to the back, but Sammy wants to continue the match. Then Ethan Page gets on the apron, and Tay pulls him off, and Page Van Zandt attacks Tay from behind and throws Tay into the steel stairs, and Scorpio wins with the TKO, a new champion. After the match, Page throws Tay into the ring, and kicks her in the head and Paige signs her AEW contract. We'll see you next week for the next Dynamite highlight.